Welcome back to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. Miles, the eighth one of the world, very much in the building. I have the ring leader, the clique leader, mm -hmm. Ume, right there beside me. And our guest for today is very much around. Now, um, let me just tell you a little, a little something about her. Her name is Eniola Omoyefa. She's a product, product manager uh, as well as a product designer. Uh, she graduated from Covenant University as the best graduating mm -hmm. student. <laughs> In asset management, you will now see where, I don't know where the asset management joined, what mm -hmm. she's doing now, but uh, she enjoys seeing products grow from inception to launch stage, and she also enjoys reading books and exercising. That I can really tell. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Eniola, what's good? How are you Hi. doing? Good morning. It's nice to have you. Let me, let me have nice I love what you're here. wearing, by the way. Thank you so did you, much. Did you uh, take a cue from Tiwa, or this is just your thing? This is just my personal style. What's, what, what, what's your color? Uh, purple is my favorite color. Why are you, why are you green and black in? Well, this is a very pretty dress. <laughs> Actually, act how many compliments have you got for the dress? A lot. Like, so you know, let me let me make a way and say I'm turning heads. I need to turn right? heads on TV today. <laughs> well, you, you are doing that. So welcome to the show. Thank um, you. So we're going to try and be as as nice as possible. We're not really nice people here, but we are nice on the other hand. Now, the elections came and... They are gone now, and the new government is coming in, and everything. And it's a whole lot. The use are a lot of use are not even happy about the outcome. While some are just okay about it. I've seen I've seen a bunch of your interviews where people talk to you about. Now you took it upon yourself, like ladies and the youth. They don't have time for election. Yeah. What, what's my what's my that's yeah. What like you took it upon yourself to do something remarkable by launching an app where people can monitor and can be educated about the elections. Fill me in. Okay, Firstly, so did your parents are your parents politicians? No, they're not. We'll get to that. Let's, let's go. <laughs> okay, so it's me and two other co founders. So I am the product manager for the product. Okay. So I, it's me, female, yeah, and then two other male co founders. Okay. So we have the software developer. Oh. I was in, in charge of like the back end coding, and then we I have, know, yeah. yeah, and then we but have. What led to it? What, like, what, what were you guys, what were you thinking about? Like, okay. there's so many things yes, to do. I need to do, I want to sell fashion, I want to get clothes. Yeah. You something. know, like, lots of those markets are really, I won't say oversaturated, but right. you have lots of um, tech apps coming in fashion, fintech, you know, mm. that's what everybody is doing. True. But relating to that period in time, the election period where, you know, Lack of information was actually something that was rampant. You know, I think lots of people didn't even know about the electoral acts. I don't know if people know that there's an electoral act. You know, so where all the information regarding the electoral process, the laws that are guiding the election, like, okay, if you do this, you're fined for five million naira. Hmm. People are not even aware. So that was the main idea behind creating this app. Then when we were able to prove that concept that, okay, we can digitize this act, we decided to make it more fun. We had like, games, trivia, quizzes. Uh, polling units, uh, political parties and candidates as well. So basically just your one-stop app for everything regarding the elections. The, 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 the election. So like in, in your first, uh, how, like how many downloads did you have all together? We had over 2,000 downloads wow. on the Google Play Store and then the Apple Store. Oh my God, that's, I mean, you, people, you people are already cashing out. I'll, I'll, see you, I'll see you after this. So now when you, when you decided to do this, was it something you discussed with your folks? Did you have the conversation with, my, with your parents? Like, uh, parents, I want to do X, Y, Z. Do you think it's something smart, or do you have like, uh, do you have like a mentor you go to? Like, do you think this will work? This will be a good thing for me to do. Yeah. Okay. So we have a mentor. My parents are really supportive with what I want to do, as long as it's legal and I'm not like breaking uh, any laws. So if you decide to be a stripper now, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, it's legal. So. Okay. Well, not in that sense. Okay, I just, want, I just wanted to be sure. Thank <laughs> God you cleared that. Okay. Professionally, oh, that's a professional job, so actually. Okay. Uh, we had one on the show a while back. Really? And yeah, so moving on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so yeah, that's basically it. They are chill with it as long as it's nothing. And we're basically non partisan, so we're not mm. supporting all oh, this particular yeah, person. I, sh I should be. Exactly. So nobody was like coming for all of us or coming at us like, oh no, don't. Okay, so now that the elections are over. Like you as, I'm sure you had your candidates. I don't want to know who your candidate was. Like, uh, how do you feel about it? What, what, what are the emotions after that? How do you feel? What are your expectations, you? Okay. After, as a Nigerian youth now. Yeah, after the elections, I mean, there were lots of mixed feelings involved. I had to disconnect from the news for a while mm. just to regroup myself and... Because, I mean, it was rough. But anyways, the... <laughs> I, I, already know, I already know who you supported. We're moving on. <laughs> the expectations after the elections, basically just one of hope, hoping that things get better for us. And, you know, 
I personally didn't. I didn't vote. That's how 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 what's that word what's that bad english bad word i don't, I don't look for a good word mm. a very bad one how double standard how can you be <laughs> talking about something that has to do with the elections and, you, did not and you are you are even you even invested in something that has to do with election and you did not vote why i mean it's not something i didn't want to i wanted to but at the time of registration and everything i was in school and so I couldn't leave to like come out. And we don't do voting in my school. So like oh. they didn't come in school to register us. So I know that a lot of people that went to my school didn't vote as well because it was not possible when school. For, for like, you to get come exactly. out come out. Yeah, I, I know your school so, and the, yeah. the, the, the yeah, so. high school, the glorified high school. <laughs> so, so you <laughs> let insight. Yeah. Okay. So my question is ever since you launched this um project, um what reach like do you think your project has gotten to so many people like large um, number of people well i think there's still people that could benefit from it especially places where you know probably they need ussd codes or like sms information because it's not everybody that has access to maybe social um internet or like all these things so that's one of the things that we're also looking at one of the solutions rather than just having it on the App Store, also providing via USSD codes and SMSs. And I'm also looking at going, well, I say global, like okay. apart from just Nigeria, other countries in Africa as well. So yeah, so I was going to ask you that because uh, pff, election is over. We might not be having yeah. another one to like five, in another four, four months, four, uh, four, four years, years, sorry. Yeah. And thereabouts. So it's that, it's the app just going to be dumb, it's just going to be yeah. there. Like we created this and let's just wait for another four years. Yes, so I was, make it about, active again. I was even about to ask, um, are you, for now, like he said, the elections are over. So, are you guys going to implement other things on the exactly. app or it will just be for... Dormant sale. Yeah, yeah that's one, an idea that we're also looking at, you know, just, not just leaving it there for Nigeria, but then we're also trying to help other, like Sierra Leone, for example, the okay. ele yeah. election is in June, July. So, we're already working towards building something similar for oh. them as well. So that you know they can also get the same benefits that we had in Nigeria and the other countries as well, you know, Ghana, Zimbabwe. Mm. So it's not just limited to Nigeria okay. per se, because our our goal is to help um, one country at a time. So we're not just limited to Nigeria. And then even in future, like four years from now, it's going to be like a repository. Be like, oh, what happened? past four years who were the people that were actually running for the election and all so it's not just doesn't just die with the election period. oh so you guys are going to have different apps for different yeah well, i thought you guys were going to like merge everything like in the app there's there's a page for um okay. Sierra Leone, there's a page for ghana yeah it's and, different oh, apps for different okay. countries because okay. you also have to look at color i mean that's going very deep but nigeria's yeah, color is like green, green. So if you're going to Sierra Leone, you have to use blue because we have like someone in Sierra Leone that is informing us and they're oh, like you okay. can't use green because green is kind of partisan yeah um to so the party, yeah, whichever party, party, yeah, exactly. So. Okay. All right, so uh, one question, okay. pardon, pardon, excuse me. Now, is it because are you doing this because you and be sincere and they say all liars will go to hell? Okay. So, are you doing this because you want to make money? One, are you doing this because you want to be famous? Two, are you doing this because you genuinely love politics and care about your country and other countries around the world? Okay, let me start from the back. If you lie, I, I don't, Thunder is somewhere. I'm not. Uh, I would say I'm 100% into politics, like, oh, this is my life's passion and my life's goal. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, I have other passions as well. But right. Okay, and then about the money, it's a social impact project. <laughs> so what we're doing is, <laughs> what we're doing is looking for funds in, like, grants, you know, UK aid, uh, so TEA Foundation, you know, all those foundations that they provide funding for um, startups and all uh, investors as well mm. and you asked one last question i cannot remember yeah like is it for the money is it because you really genuinely love your country and other yeah. countries <laughs> or you're into policy you've answered you've answered yeah. like okay. both so, of them but just okay 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 so my other question is um what achievements like what are your achievements so far bam yeah. Okay, with the app. Why? Why it's fine? Like, no, 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 no. <laughs> like with the, with the situation in Nigeria. <laughs> yes, with the app. With the app. With the yes. app when you're laughing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Um, like you said, we've got in over two thousand downloads, and prior to that, we also had um incentive. Like well, I won't say incentives, but try to create awareness on um social media, like Instagram. You know, so we helped to. Dis disseminate information regarding polling units, the locations, how to get your PVC, also to know your rights. Like for example, when uh, one of the candidates raised up their ballot paper and 
showed everybody like it's even in the laws that it's not allowed okay. and there's also like <laughs> oh. a fine for that so if people knew about it like a mass number of people knew about it i spoke up about it so, something could have actually been done. so what about that guy that was singing lup was that right lup so was it <laughs> i think that was those vibes eh? yeah was it was vibe but was that's not against like any, him any calling out the name. LUP74. LUP75. I, I don't think... You don't. Like the counting process. Yeah, the counting process. Like dis disturbing them. No, like the counting process. Yeah. He was singing like, LUP. Yeah, yes, I remember that. So, you, there, there's nothing wrong with that. No. He's, he's, he's okay today. Okay. <laughs> so, um, sorry, my other que my okay. last question, rather, is um, now, you, not everybody is on social media. Not everybody has an Android phone. Eh. But not yes now okay we still have people areas. who are yeah rural yeah. primitive yeah. people so um you right your car doesn't have <laughs> so what are you doing what what is your team doing yeah. to you know reach, uh, yeah, reach these kind of people, people. Yeah. yeah so as i said earlier like we have this idea where we want to use and about mobile phones i mean at least you should have the Small Nokia. Phone. Do they do? Do the they do uh, WhatsApp? Do the they small do? GSM phones. Oh, yeah, yeah, exactly. Small, yeah, small, okay. oh. them, yeah. Uh -huh. So USSD codes, oh, okay, SMS okay, messages. Okay, okay. Can also use that as well because I know an app is quite big, big for yeah. some. All right, cool. I'm gonna I'm gonna take you away from that just a bit. Let's just let's take a breather. Um, do you do music? Do you listen to music, or you just you're just in your books like two four no, seven? No, I listen to music. What kind of music do you listen to? I like Afro beats and I like pop. And you like pop. Okay, so Nigerian musicians, like, your top three will be who, who, and who? Um, I like David Doe. One. I like Bonner Boy. Is this in a particular order? No particular no order. Particular okay, order. Bonner Boy. Bonner Boy and... Who will be my third? I like... Um, okay, I, I'll just give you two. <laughs> no, you have to, you have three? to get three, yeah. One okay, more. Uh, the last person will be... Uh, my uncle. Okay, okay, yeah. let's make it. Is it big? I think, it, was he a student of your school? His, okay, he wasn't. No, no, no. Okay, cool. Babcock. I thought he was, he was even going to say... No, well, I, I love Johnny Drill. Sorry. Jo okay. So, Are you just mentioning guys? So Johnny Drill. Don't, yeah, that's, that's, oh, that's, oh. Uh, <laughs> not mentioning anything. Have you, have you been to their school before? <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, cool. Before we get back to those three names you mentioned, now, yeah. we, ha we had a story on here earlier yeah. about uh, Mr. P giving someone a kiss. What mm. do you think about that? Honestly, Honestly when you were, were talking about it and I was sitting back there, I felt really bad for that lady that like he forcefully kissed her. He didn't forcefully kiss her. He, it was it was. Well, yeah, it, was, it wasn't forceful. Like, but yeah, he kissed her. I mean, when, on the mouth. Like, I mean, I feel no should be no. Like, if she actually tried to avoid it the first time, she's not taking the hint and maybe found somebody else that wanted to be kissed. You get and he's married. Mm. How do you find people who want to spread mouth bacteria? Uh, there are people, people that are people who are celebrity. Ready. Like, you not wash their mouth. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah, Yeah. true. laughs> <laughs> 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 anyway, so what if you were the wife of the so-called I wouldn't, I wouldn't like that. I mean, first of all, I don't think I'd get married to an entertainer. Never say never. What if that is? What if you meet a John Drew? Look, look at look at Mr. Easy. He's an artist, and he's yeah. getting married to. Timmy. And they are so they're not they don't have the whole uh, artist uh, yeah. paparazzi lifestyle. What if that's the kind of person you meet, and you just find like oh behind the whole. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm an entertainer. He's actually a very, very sweet, homely guy. What okay, if? Okay, like and I'm, he's now performing one day, and this happens in the heat of the moment. Excuse me, sir. Please Ooh. calm down. <laughs> but look at um, Ag Baby, for example, and mm. Simi. Like he's also an entertainer, but he's a good entertainer. Yeah, he has he has, he has values. values. Do you understand? Yeah. He has a daughter. But when he's performing, he's, Mr. he's he P gives has that. children. Not it's very well. obvious that. Yeah, there's <laughs> a difference between. Wow. <laughs> wow. This is this is amazing. Anyway, for the people you mentioned, you mentioned Burner Boy, David O and John and Trail. So who are you getting married to? Who are you kissing and who are you slapping? Uh I'll slap Burner Boy. Uh, wow. <laughs> and I'll marry uh Johnny I, I I saw that coming. <laughs> and what was the last one? Uh, David Joe. Married. I mean, yeah. You married Okay, yeah. thank you. You kissed David. I don't want to kiss David, but like, since that's the last option. <laughs> wow. Juma. <laughs> wow. I don't want to wow. I don't want to kiss David. Uh, okay, so yeah. before before we let you go now, how can we reach you on all your social media platforms? And whoever wants to check out the uh, what's it called the handle for the app, how do we okay, go about that? Okay, on Instagram and on Twitter, it's at voteinfo underscore ng. So what what do we what we what do we what do we 
came to learn when we go there. So if, I, if I'm just going to go and wait my daughter, because they, Instagram, we chopped it out. Uh, so if I'm going there now, like, what am I going to learn? I mean, basically information about the election that passed. Mm. And I'm thinking for future purposes, it's necessary to also talk about things that are happening in the present. True. What is happening um, in you know, the political um, realm right Swear. now. Yeah. Exactly. So those are things I would also look into as well. Mm. Okay, so what about you? How do we follow you? Okay, Don't you want to be known? My... Are you married? You are, you are, you are no, running for a boy. <laughs> Put that your handle. Let's enter your DM. My handle is underscore black toffee. So yeah, that's on What gave birth to black toffee? Uh, yeah, you look, you're black and... You look like Toffee. <laughs> <laughs> no, okay. but it just sounded like a catchy name. Is, my yeah. nickname is any because my name is Enyola, and people call me Any Pops. Any Pops. Any Pops, like P O P S. I don't know. Any it just pops. came up in school, so that's pops. like my, my Twitter your pops. handle, like your Pops. Yeah, like, what's pops. popping? What's pops. popping? <laughs> right. This is about where we're about to pop the balloon on the show today we gotta go it's been amazing but this is where we draw the curtains today but thank you for watching as always join the conversation on social media with the hashtag tea time and remember you can catch up on our previous episodes including this very one and all our exclusive contents by subscribing to our youtube channel at plus tv africa lifestyle you can also watch tea time on r2 tv and if you're in london you can watch it on ben television and star time channel 308 a big thank you to clarita and Uime for holding it down and my studio guest eniola for holding out the black toffee herself. I hope we're going to have this conversation again on a bigger platform. I mean, like, I told you guys now, ah, we are in City Alone, you, we are in Zimbabwe, you. I'm like, yeah, I will have a visor or something. I don't yeah. because, but thank you so much thank for, you so for, much being, for, for, for being here. You want to give a shout out to someone before you go? Uh, I'd like to give a shout out to my team and my uh, family and my friends as well. They have names now. I should start mentioning yeah. it. Mm, not so much. Not me no past three. Okay, I'd like to give a shout out to Josh, to Simon, and to David. That's it. You have to <laughs> mention David. We gotta go. Whatever it is you do, do not drink and drive. Food God first and the rest is history. Drink a lot of water and mind your business. It helps you live longer. We out.